Hi guys, we're R Nights. I'm Ray. I'm Alex. And uh, we're about to react to episode three of Gravity Falls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> God, this is so good. This is so good. I'm actually uh, looking forward to the game. <laughs> Who knows? I, I, I don't know what to expect in these episodes. Me either. You know, and I just know it's going to be enjoyable me either, me either. when uh, they, when it does pop up and like. Yes, I I think it's gonna be a dragon. I, at this point, at this point, a I, dragon. It's, yeah, <laughs> it can be anything at this point. I'm loving the characters. I'm, well, okay, this is what I, I'm gonna predict. All right, what, I don't know how many episodes they are. I think there's two seasons. Yeah. So there should be aliens coming out in one of these. There right? has to be. There with, has to with, be. With, with Grandpa doing counterfeit money mm -hmm. and the jail and whatnot, there might be the mafia involved so, at some yep. point in the show. Yep. Uh, there could be something like a Frankenstein involved. Uh, also, like some classical stuff like yeah. this. Yeah. We saw. We think the mailman's a werewolf. That's what. Yep. Right. Yep. So there might be a werewolf involved in this. You mentioned that the gnomes will be back. If the gnomes come back, who knows how they're gonna come yeah. back? If they do come back. And we still don't know how. We still don't know with uh, Uncle. <clears throat> we don't know what he has under under the shop. There's something down there. We, yeah. we saw him yeah. go. What does he have down there? There's something about Uncle that I'm like. I think he's smarter than he looks, but I, I wonder what is actually down there. What does he have down there? What does he does he know something? He has to know something we don't know. He's Oh, do you think he's doing he's part of all of this and trying to cash in people to come into his shop and buy stuff? Like he's part of the the the, the, the making this out to be the I, weird place and people should come in and check this out. Our, I feel like our minds are gonna be blown. I feel like I feel like this show. I feel like was, was, was that, we're, our was minds Grunkle, are going to be blown. Grunkle, our Grunkle? minds are going to be blown. I'm calling it right now. Well, listen, let's not waste any time. Let's, get let's right do it. it. Episode three. Let's go right into it. Headhunters. So let's see what's going to go on with this episode. What? Detective. These messages. Just by smelling your breath, I can tell that you have been eating an entire tube of toothpaste? It was so sparkly. <sighs> oh! You'll never guess what I found! <clears throat> so I was cleaning up when I found the secret door hidden behind the wallpaper. It's crazy, bonkers, creepy. You might have said, Grandpa. Wow. It's a secret wax museum. It's so lifelike. Except for that one. Hello! <laughs> <laughs> it's just me, your Grunkle Stan! <laughs> this is so creepy. <laughs> what? There's music. What? <laughs> oh, no, you know, dude. No, 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 a bunch no, no. of uh, wax museum figures? The last thing I need is spirits on this show. <laughs> the last thing I need is spirits on this show. Some type of conjuring type of... Oh, uh, no, no, no. God forbid Mabel gets possessed. Oh, no, 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 no. That's the last thing I need. I don't know if we can handle it. I guess Con, Sherlock Holmes, some kind of, <laughs> I don't know, goblin man. Goblin man. And now for my personal favorite, Wax Abraham Lincoln. Right over. Oh, 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 oh the light. Oh, the sunlight. On. Who left the blinds open? Wax John Wilkes Booth. I'm looking in your. Oh, oh no. Goodness. Dear Lord. Here. Cheer up, Grunkle Stan. Where's that smile? Nah. Keep up. Ow. Just give me Don't height. worry, Grunkle Stan. I'll make you a new wax figure from all this old wax. <laughs> Maybe you should carve something from real life. Like a waffle with big arms. Okay, or, you know, something else. Like, like someone in your family. Kids, have you seen my pants? Oh, Muse, <laughs> you work in mysterious ways. Why is your sister talking to the ceiling? Is this wax or stone? What the? I think it needs more glitter. Agreed. The wax museum's back in business. I want to see it. Corn oh, dogs. I would tear up a corn dog right now. You all know me, folks. Town darling, Mr. Mystery. Please, ladies, control yourself. <laughs> the people of this fair town, novelties and befuddlements, the likes of which the world has never known. But enough about me. Behold. Me! That came out great. <laughs> Pretty good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's covered 
covered in my blood, sweat, tears, and other fluids. Uh, <laughs> 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 Old Man McGuffin, local kook, are the wax figures alive and follow-up question, can I survive the wax man uprising? Uh, wax man yes. uprising? Next question. To be determined, grab it. The world? Your microphone's a turkey baster, Toby. It Oof. certainly is. Your flyers promised free pizza with admission to this event. Is this true? That's fine. That was a typo. Good night, everyone! <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I think that went well. Where are you gonna get pizza out here? Well, I'm gonna use the John. You need anything? <clears throat> <laughs> I love this guy. Don't you go nowhere. Poor Greg. Poor Greg. He's so alone. Oh no. Wax Dan. He's been m murdered. <sighs> the goat ate it. They called the cops. There must be evidence, motives. You know, I can help if you want. He's really good. Ooh, well, you look at what we got here. City Boy thinks he's gonna solve a mystery with his fancy computer phone. City Boy! City Boy! <laughs> Attention all units. Steve is going to fit an entire cantaloupe in his mouth. Repeat, an entire cantaloupe. It's a 2316! Let's move. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, it's a joke. <laughs> and we'll see who's a... Adorable. Aww, you right, like a that was king. adorable. The murderer could have been anyone. Yes, even us. In this town, anything is possible. Ghosts, zombies, could be months before we find our first clue. Hey, look, a clue. Footprints in the shag carpet. That's weird. They've got a hole in them. And they're leading to. <gasps> so, what do you think? In my opinion, this is an axe. Wait a minute. <laughs> the lumberjack! Of, of course. course! In your face! We have an axe! Free! 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 Uh, <laughs> seems like the kind of thing a responsible parent wouldn't want you doing. Good thing I'm an uncle. Avenge me, kids! Go do it! <laughs> <laughs> this is the place. Oh my um, goodness, I'll go fracture? Sorry, but we Head don't serve miners. <laughs> Dang, never miners. We're here to interrogate so Manly Dan the Lumberjack for the murder of Wax Dan. Works for me. Oh my goodness. It's not a good place. Yeah, sure. Manly Dan, just the guy I wanted to see. Where were you last night? Punching the clock. You were at work. No, I was punching that clock. 10 o'clock, the time of the murder. So, I guess you've never seen this before? Listen, little girl. Hey, actually, I'm... I wouldn't pick my teeth with that axe. It's left-handed. I only use my right hand. The manly hand. Jesus Christ. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Three, Three, four, five, six. <gasps> Your wife is going to be beautiful. <laughs> Big break in the case. I remember those. But will she love me? I remember those. Pick a number. I remember, yeah, pick a number. Pick a color. Pick a color. <laughs> that means one person left on this list. Of course, it all adds up. Ah! Nobody move. This is a raid. Ah! What is this? Some kind of raid? <laughs> Tony determined. You're under arrest for the murder of the wax body of Grunkle Stan. You were hoping that Grunkle Stan's new attraction would be the story that saved your failing newspaper. But when the show was a flop, you decided to go out and make your own headline. And all the clues pointed to a shabby shoe reporter who was caught left-handed. Tell me determined, you're yesterday's news. Boy, your little knees must be sore from jumping to conclusions. Ha-cha-cha. <laughs> I had nothing to do with that murder. I knew it. Wait, How's what it, did what? you say? Huh? Nothing? We said nothing. Finally, we can be alone. Cardboard cut out of female newsroom. Oh, my goodness. Good Lord. Heaven. Oh. Uh. Timestamp confirmed. Toby, <laughs> you're on the hook. You freaking mates. Hooray. <laughs> but, but it has to be him. No prints at all. 
No prints? Hey, I got a headline for you. City kids waste everyone's time. <laughs> Boy, I'd be pretty embarrassed if I was you two. <laughs> So bad. <sighs> wax Stan's shoe has a hole in it. All the wax guys have that. It's where the pole thingy attaches to their stand dealies. Wait a minute. That's what another one? Holes in its shoes and no fingerprints. Mabel, the murderers are standing right behind you. What? Wax Coolio? What's up, home? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We're cursed. Cursed. <laughs> Just to come to life whenever the go at a garage <clears throat> sale. A hundred garage sales, son. Twenty dollars? I'll just take them when you're not looking. What? I said I was gonna rob you. And so the mystery. Gee, wait, did he rob them for real? So how long have they been done it for? Ten years uh, to get our revenge on Stan for locking us away. Oh, no one to kill Stan. Jeez. with hotty melty things oh. anyone move and we'melt you into candles decorative candles jeez <laughs> oh <laughs> oh interview this Larry King my neck my beautiful neck <laughs> oh Genghis Khan for Julio You got any sunscreen? Got any. What? <gasps> no! Fiddlesticks! Humbugs! It's a total Oh, what a horrible way to go. Case closed. <laughs> you sneeze like a kitten. Those policemen were right. You're adorable. <laughs> <laughs> what a horrible way to go. Hot belts and waffles! What happened to my parlor? Your wax figures turned out to be evil, so we fought them to the death! I decapitated Larry King. <laughs> you kids and your imaginations. On the bright side, though, look what we found. My head! Solve the case yet, Ma? I'm so confident you're gonna say no, that I'm gonna take a long, slow sip from my cup of coffee. Actually, <laughs> the answer is yes. <laughs> Oh. oh. Really? Jesus. <laughs> so, did you get rid of all the wax figures? I am 99% sure that I did. Good enough for me. Oh, no. Hmm. Hey, Dipper, I love these. What do you think is better, sequence or llama hair? The llama hair. Llamas are nature's greatest warriors. What? Thanks, Dipper. Yeah. That was so freaky. <laughs> well, that was episode what? three. What the? Heck? I did not. I, I, I did not see that. that coming. I didn't expect that happening. I either. did not see that <clears> coming. I was trying to figure out what's going to happen this episode. I did not see. Yeah. And the last thing I th thought was like these things will come to life because of some curse. It's around. crazy how. Like, I saw them, but when he started investigating, like, my mind went away from the figures. Like, I, there's, I was not expecting them to come alive. No, same There's here. just no, that threw me off. That's not, because I know, I, I want to figure out what's going to happen every episode because of the way it is. Yep. You know? And I didn't think, like you said, I didn't think it was going to be the, 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 You caught me. The, no, they got me. They, they got me. Like I did not expect that. I did not expect Again, that. Again, another entertaining episode. That yep. was excellent. Excellent yep. show. Um... Anything, uh, these, these, these cops, do you like these cop characters? I hate them. They're so <laughs> trash. They're so, tr they're so trash. They're so tr <laughs> We have somebody about to put a pickle in their mouth. And he's like, that's a 2615. We gotta go. <laughs> that, I do, I expect no help from these guys. And I know they're going to be back for more episodes. I, well, I'm sure. Well, that, that's what you're saying because there's a couple of, okay. So far, recurring characters have been Zeus. Yep. Wendy. Yep. Of course, the main three. Yep. 
Uh, now, now I see the old man came back with the beard and the. Uh, he's back. He came to his up. He's this back. Episode. Um, the, the big dude, the big, the big angry dude, dude, the big yep. angry dude. Um, and then the cops. The cops. The cops. Yep. So I guess he's, he's gonna be a recurring character throughout the show and whatnot. Yeah. Yeah. But of those who are returning back, I do like that big guy. I love. Him. Just rip the arm of the guy. Just, I love him. Know, it's not manly. I'm calling right now. I think. I think the. I think they're gonna partner up with him somehow. I feel like he's gonna be either a part of the group, or they're gonna. He's. There'll be a mystery involving him. Yeah. Just him and his family. Yeah. I feel like. I feel like they're going to somehow. They're gonna get together. I. I might be wrong, but I have a feeling. I have a feeling that he's gonna join the team. I have a feeling. Well, I agree. I, I have agree. a feeling. Yeah. Yep. Again, I'm, the show is fantastic. I'm enjoying these characters. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. If I mentioned it before. I found out that um, the creator of Rick and Morty. Came out of the show. I think they they, they worked in the show before. Makes total sense. So they, the way is, they, you sense. can see some of the comedy, or at least the influence of this yeah. going to Rick and Morty. Makes total sense. Makes total sense. I'm loving it so far. What do yeah. I mean, guys? We are our nights. This was Gravity Falls episode three. Episode three. Yep. Uh, I'm Ray. I'm Alex. Guys, we'll see you soon. Take care. Take care, guys.